This right here, this is my problem solver. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Secure the baggy, I get the bus. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Secure the baggy, I get the bus. I want you guys to know that uh, the scope on this isn't zeroed and you saw how just pinpoint accuracy I had on that course of fire. Cash money like five or four, ball like eight, two, four. No sleep, no more, no more. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drip, I get it up. I'm in my car and I get it up. I get the bag, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drip, I get it up. I'm in my car and I get it up. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. I'm a real one, my day one. Gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I'm your host of Talking Balakava. Today we're going over my cursed gun. This is my American Idol cursed gun audition tape to be on Brandon Herrera's cursed gun segment. I love this segment very much and I always love popping in and watching his cursed guns that he goes over. And well, you know what? I thought the time has come I make my very own cursed gun. And damn, this thing's pretty cursed. So we'll go over <laughs> this gun. We'll go, um, we'll go from butt to tip because I'm more of a butt guy myself. So <laughs> this is a high point 995 carbine. I did the yellow spray paint along with the pink accent highlights to really show off the gun. Um, I find that, you know, bad guys may be looking for a camouflage spray paint gun. So I figured we could really throw them for a loop by going with yellow and pink. No bad guys gonna be looking for that color scheme. So you should be okay, right? And it kind of blends in. No, not at all. All right, so I properly named this gun the Problem Solva. My Glock 40, this is my Problem Solva right here. And that has been a perfect running meme joke in gun culture. And well, it is my Problem Solva. It's fantastic. I even have the custom folding stock. It comes, um, it comes like this from the factory from High Point. So really pretty slick, but they do require you to have on a um, your proprietary latch. But what do you do? You know what I mean? So that's that's okay. Then we got this uh, V Life uh, three by nine by forty optic on here. You know, like I was saying earlier, guns not zeroed, so um, you know, it just really comes good out of the box, I guess, to throw on your nine nine five carbines. Uh, we got this Ghost Print Tactical. It is a 3D printed airsoft part. I figured it was perfect for this gun considering how much I throw it. I need parts that won't break under stress. Damn, look at that, nothing. Chinese looking flashlight, lumen out put on this, actually impressive. I rigged it up to the pistol grip back here. That way if I need to activate the light, I can always remove my digits from up front, put it back here, activate the light, control the gun. The gun's light enough to control from the rear. And so I figured that'd be okay back here as well as, as well as I can control it from the tape switch on my hand, thumb, whatever method, all right? It's, it's a preference thing up to me. You can always rig up your gun however you want. Got the Airsoft Pec 16 up here. The reason I want the Airsoft Pec is I wanted to throw this on the forums, but I didn't want to be called poor, so I figured I'd throw a Pec on there. I didn't want to spray paint it because in case I want to resell it, you know, night vision guys often get out of night vision because they have no friends to go shoot night vision with, but uh, you know, this Airsoft Pec should do me pretty good, so. You know, so far so good. Um, I find that the setup with the folding stock allows for a lot more uh, tight confined working space and really good vehicle work and stuff like that. But ultimately this gun exists so I can, um, you know, shoot out my chance, shoot my shot to get on to Brandon Herrera's cursed gun segment. Gentlemen, thanks for stopping by. Much appreciated, like and subscribe. Do all the YouTube things, Patreon merchandise, Tell your mom about me. As always, gentlemen, stay easy, stay breezy. I'll catch you all on the flip. Right, that fall.
the flashlight bends, but it doesn't break. Something biblical there. Nice, let's go get some pictures.